Hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats, and today we have a new Costco item for you. I don't know how new, new it is, but it's only recently come to our store, and I was excited to see it. This is the Kirkland Signature Lightly Breaded Chicken Breast Chunks Breaded Boneless Skinless Chicken Breast Portions Fully Cooked, and it is a 64 ounce, four pound bag of frozen chicken. The bag is resealable. It is $13.99. And most interestingly, this is the kind of competitor or like ripoff of the Just Bear Chicken Nuggets, which was inspired by the Chick-fil-A Chicken Nuggets. Yeah, so on the internet, people are saying these are like the, the Costco version of the Chick-fil-A Nuggets. Mm -hmm. um, looking at it, it looks good. It does, and I would say it looks similar to the Just Bear, but I do think that the breading looks a little different, possibly a little bit thicker, but not by much. So how much did you say the price was? This is $13.99 for the four pound bag. So not bad. Not bad, the bag is resealable, which I like. Which is really huge. Yes. And guys, if you're new to our channel, basically we review our day grocery items before you spend your hard earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. Now we reviewed the Just Bear Chicken Nuggets not long ago. Yes. Those are really good. Now Costco, they um, the Kirkland brand could be good sometimes, other times not so much. Mm -hmm. um, I think the best product they make probably is the lasagna. Oh yeah. You know? Yeah. And uh, taking a look at these, not oily. Yeah. It smells good, but you know what? It doesn't feel like there's a lot of chicken in it because it oh, looks really? like, yeah, when I squeeze it, it seems a little hollow. Oh. Um, but you How's know, look there inside? is kind of, I mean, yeah. this breading is a little thick, so eh, we'll see. Let's go for it. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right, guys, welcome back to our rating system. Thumbs up right again, thumbs down or not. So for me, this is a thumbs down. Going into this, the expectations was very high. Unfortunately, this thing um, needed more seasoning. Now, before the break, I did say that it didn't feel like there was a lot of chicken inside of it. There was, so no issues there. I liked the breading. I liked how fried it was. I just didn't like the inside. I felt like the chicken inside could have been seasoned better. Because um, the first one I had, it was like there was no seasoning in it. The others, it's all right. Didn't really do anything. If you guys don't know, we have a whole chicken nugget playlist. We did a whole chicken nugget week. Mm -hmm. So we've tried a lot of chicken nuggets. And um, so when I'm reviewing this, I'm thinking of those also, right? Mm -hmm. And I feel like this is not even close. I think there's better products out there. I think the main issue is the, the inside. Could be seasoned better the outside. It's good. I just think the inside needs to be seasoned better. Thumbs down. If you like what we're doing here, please consider sending us super thanks. It helps us continue to provide more amazing content. Alrighty, that's interesting. For me, this one is going to be a thumbs down. Different reason though. And I will go out on a limb and say, I dare say that I probably like it more than you do, yeah. based on your review and how I feel about it. But even though it's a little cheaper than the Just Bear, I think I would still rather spend more money for the Just Bear because to me, this one, the breading is a little bit too thick. Yeah. I like that the Just Bear really are like very thinly breaded. I like a thick breading. Really? Yeah, I do, yeah. Yeah. Oh, but then it's like, that's half of the nugget is breading. I don't mind. Ooh, you know? okay. Yeah. I like the fact with this one, it's thick and the breading is cooked properly. Hmm. Sometimes I think if it's a thick, breading it's not always cooked that's like, true i like it a little bit more like well done yeah yeah yeah. now i'll agree with you on that the breading it's not obnoxious in that it's like doughy or anything yeah. like that to me it's just a little bit too heavy like it's okay i i feel like i eat a few nuggets like this and then it's like all that breading is just like accumulating and yeah. it feels like it sits a little bit too heavy so I would prefer to have the just bear because of that. So you know what? That does make sense because uh, like if you're giving it to a kid, yeah. you want the kid to have more chicken than, than breading. the breading. Yeah. yeah, exactly. But thinking about like, cause I liked using the just bear ones on like cutting them up and putting them in salad or whatever. I don't want a super bready thing if I'm gonna throw it in my salad or even a wrap yeah. or something like that. So if you don't mind the breading though, like 
I think that overall this is a perfectly fine nugget if you want to save the few bucks or whatever. I do agree though that I wish that the chicken on the inside was a bit more seasoned because it was just kind of just chicken, you know, and then the whole flavor is coming from that breading. I wish that they put a little bit more thought into that, but for me, the breading was the bigger issue. So like the first one I had, you know, I just, it was especially gross. Oh really? Yeah, it was like gross. It was like now season, it was like, um, kind of like, man, um, just, it sounds like you got the piece that was meant for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was gross. I always get those pieces. Like, I didn't want to, like, eat it. And then after uh -huh. that, like, I was like, okay, is the rest of them going to be this bad? Uh -huh. um, it was better, the rest of them. But, um, so, I think there's quality issues with oh, it, okay. you know? Yeah. That's a valid point, too, because I feel like we've seen that in Costco things, the quality control issues. To sum it up, thumbs down, thumbs down. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.